So today is Friday, February 8th, and while we should be getting ready for the weekend, we're actually going to get ready for next week because it's Valentine's Day and it's the 100th day of school for Eliana. So for Valentine's Day, she has to bring Valentine's for all of her friends at school. So we have to write all the names and her name on the Valentine's. And then for the 100th day of school, they have a little bag that they have to collect a hundred of something that their class is going to try to guess what's in the bag. Do you have any ideas of what you want to put in your bag? Cheerios. Cheerios is a good idea. I can't think of anything else. Okay, should we go look in the closet upstairs? Yes. In the art supplies? Yeah. Say cheese. Cheese. You could take a good nap? <laughs> no. Why not? Okay, come give mama some love. <laughs> I love you. Night night. Okay, yeah. you ready to find your hundred stuff? So we went through all of the art supplies and stickers that we had and we decided to use the felt stickers that I had from previous projects. And so now we're going to count them to make sure that we have a hundred good ones and then we'll stick them in the bags. And we're counting all these stickers. And then we're going to put them in the bag. Ten, 10 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91. 100. 100. Good job. We nice. Got 100. So we got all of Eliana's Valentine's put together and back in the box so she can bring in the school next week. And all we have left to do is to make her teacher Valentine. We'll do that maybe tonight or sometime this weekend. But for now, we're just going to take a break from making Valentine's. Hi! <laughs> bouncy, bouncy, bouncy! You ready to go downstairs? Should we go? Hi, Ami! Are you recording, Mama? <laughs> we got so many chip choices. Sun chips, Lay's, Cheetos, Poppables, Goldfish, Eliana's. What kind of chip is that? <laughs> Hello. Show me what you learned. So today is Sunday, February 10th, and we went to church this morning, and now we are working on getting decorations on the girls' walls. We recently put them in the same bedroom, coming from separate bedrooms, and so now we are getting new decorations for their room, and I'll show you what I made last night. I got these letters from Hobby Lobby. They were just the brown color, like the wood color, and while it was nice, I didn't really want a brown letter on the brown wall. And so I painted them white and I covered them with scrapbook paper. 
So now we're gonna put them above their beds and we're also gonna add some little flowers to match the bedspread. So, really excited. So where do you want this, Kim? Like, like that. No, like how you had it. Looks you like good. it? Yeah. Okay. As you also can see, we have a lot of patches because this used to be our office and we had stuff hanging on the walls and we had a desk that attached to the wall. So we also have to go and paint all of the patches. So it's still a work in progress, but we're coming along. So cute. That's probably perfect. Yay, I love it. Are y'all cozied up? Yeah. yeah. We're ready to watch a movie. She decided she wanted to watch Brave. They are gonna watch Brave while mommy goes paint upstairs. <laughs> So today is Monday, February 11th, and while Eliana should be at school, she is actually staying home today because she just wasn't feeling well at all. So as you saw yesterday, we have these white spotches on the wall that we had to patch all the holes from when this was our office. And so today I thought I would just take the time, since we had to stay home, with Eliana being sick, I would take the time today to get them painted. taking her temperature um, throughout the day and it just kept getting higher and higher so I ended up calling the nurse and having them um, one of them to give me a call back to see if I should bring her in or not just because she didn't have too many symptoms um, but then her fever got a little too high so I just decided to call and make a sick appointment and um, I finally gave her some ibuprofen just because it got higher than the temperature I like to see so you trying to rest how you feeling? Good. You sure? Daddy just got home. Oh, I didn't hear it. Pretend like you're asleep. Are you not feeling too good? Mm. Is it good we're going to the doctor? Maybe get you better before Valentine's Day? Yeah. So we are headed off to our doctor's appointment for Eliana. Um, hopefully we can figure out what's wrong with her and get her feeling better. So we left the doctor and the diagnosis was strep and so we ended up coming to get her prescription at Walmart and now we're headed home so we can give her that first dose of medicine and hopefully get her feeling better. Are you feeling better than you were earlier? Uh-huh. Yeah. Got some medicine in her. She's going to sleep really good. I have to have it. And she can stay in her PJs tomorrow. So it's the end of our Monday and this was a pretty crazy day. Well, not really crazy, but just busy with thinking that you have one plan done mm -hmm. and just having to change it up and do something else. But that's okay, we made it to the doctor, we got some medicine, and we're gonna get this little girl feeling better so she can go to her Valentine's party on Wednesday. Since we forgot to close out our vlog on Friday and we forgot to close out our vlog on Sunday, that's why we made this a three-day vlog. So we hope you enjoyed the little bits of Friday that we filmed and the little bits of Sunday um, which was actually yesterday and the little bits of today. We're gonna end this vlog here and we'll see you for Valentine's Day. Bye!